hi everyone welcome back again to another Flutter tutorial and in this video we will be discussing regarding the development of this uh, food delivery app ui design okay so this is the ui what we will be developing as a result of this video tutorial and first starting with the main.dat file we'll be having a call to the dashboard page class so when say this class will be having uh, as a single side scroll view just to have a scrolling option okay and say that and also for the scrolling i have used the physics as bouncing scroll physics just to have this elastic kind of scrolling on both up and down so this is so in order to obtain this kind of scrolling i have used this bouncing scroll physics okay and you say the single cell scroll view option will be having a child which is the built body it is the body class and say this body class is what will be having uh, the entire components so the entire widgets what uh, i have just developed over here okay so um, just uh, leave about the height spacer so that is just a size box that is the custom function which i have used okay starting with the build location so this this is actually a function which returns a widget and it is responsible for building up this component alone as you can see here this icon the location icon as well as this text and this divider so this function is responsible for building these three followed by we have the search container okay so for now i have just used the container and the text so i haven't added any functionality yet just a simple ui alone okay so this function is concerned with the process of this rendering search box followed by build top search tags and includes this so these tags what you can see here right now so these tags uh, so this function will just render these tags at the top okay followed by which we will be having build quick select so that is nothing but this uh, a kind of uh, images what I have used in a circular or without fashion okay so that is what i have just called over here followed by at last we have the build recommendation card so that is is what is concerned with the development of all these three cards okay so that will just uh, is responsible for building up these cards the restaurant name and these tags also okay so everything is just placed inside this function call okay so i have just binded them all together to make the ui look more simple as possible okay and everything you can see over here that is inside the widgets folder i will be having all these widgets so these are all individual widgets as said before okay that is all pairs inside the widgets folder okay and this is all about the ui screens and inside the repository folder we will be having uh, the details the details of the restaurant and the images and all these things okay you can see here you can just note down that the tags the items the restaurant name and the time delivery time whether it is a favorited or not and the offers everything i have just defined over here in this class so this is all this all comes under the repository folder and say the general widgets i'll be having the simple custom defined with widgets which is the size box just to have spacing on uh, horizontal and vertical banner okay and inside the declaration folder i'll be having a global declaration which is responsible or it is concerned with the colors which i have primarily used for this app okay the three colors what i have used for the development process inside that we'll be having the images and say the images will be having the images file which is which contains all the images what i have used entirely for this screen alone okay so all the image file i have just defined over here in a list view or in the list i have just wrapped them inside the list so that i can make use of the iteration process to repeatedly render the different images and inside the dashboard declaration files i'll be having just defining the colors so this colors is nothing but the tag colors predominantly so the tag color and the text inside the tag so that are all just defined over here in this that file okay so this is just the folder structure what i have used for rendering this dashboard screen okay so with this idea let's move on to the coding part all right as i said before 
so this body class is responsible for rendering all the components one by one and let us just make use of the components which i have just predefined and bind them together to attain the ui okay first let me just provide a certain spacing at the top with the help of the height spacer function and let me just give the space that is the pixels how much how many pixels i just need to leave at the top so i will be leaving a gap of 15 pixels okay and followed by which the first widget which is the build location okay the build location widget and it's it does not take any parameter just just call the function alone okay and after a hot restart occurs you can able to see the output okay um here we got the output after the build location we just need to leave again a spacing of uh, 10 pixels okay after that the next uh, widget what we need to build is build search container okay so this search container so it is just the ui stuff i haven't added any functionality yet okay so let, let us see how okay we got the search container followed by again a height spacer and this time it's 15 pixels okay and the next widget what we need to build is the search top sorry the build top select i think top select tags okay so this is all the tags we just have at the top with the horizontal scrolling option okay so let's see how it this renders okay and see it is this rendering the items we have added a horizontal scrolling the same bouncing scroll physics Okay. and next we just need to have again as height spacer uh, 20 pixels and followed by which we will be having the build pick select tags okay this is just the circular of the order which i have just defined in the discussion part the list of eight images okay just to make the user quickly select between the categories I have just made use of this widget okay and again followed by them we'll be having again a height spacer with a pixel of 25 and at last the uh, most important uh, widget which is the build recommendation card and so this function alone takes the context as the parameter okay and let's see how this renders them well this renders them correctly so the images the restaurant name tags and the ratings everything is just placed in this position okay so these are all these all things these all data comes from the repository folder so i have just defined you earlier now so just mapping those text that is those data to the corresponding uh, widget tree okay so we just apply in this ui okay so that's all with the UI stuff. So as of now, I haven't added any functionality for the search as well as the on-click event. If you want to add functionality or if you want me to continue with this UI screen, just comment them. And if I get a considerable number of comments, then I will just uh, release a part two video of the same. Okay. So if you just enjoy this video, consider subscribing and I will see you in the next one. Bye.